start by bringing their shoulders up towards their ears, taking a deep inhale through the nose and just a long cleansing breath. Exhale out the mouth. And then allow yourself to drop in. So notice if you feel already when you close your eyes, distracted, restless, agitated, whatever comes up for you that may already just in simply closing your eyes, pull you away from being present with your breath in your body in this moment. And there is no judgment of yourself in this practice. This is simply to be able to observe if there are patterns that are pulling you away from enjoying the present moment or accepting it as it is. And if you do feel that, just note it. And then take another deep inhale through your nose. And exhale out your mouth. Now begin to notice the rise and the fall of your breath in your body. Allow yourself to relax into the breath, into the pattern, the rhythm of the breath. And if you find for yourself that the pattern, the rhythm of the breath isn't providing you a sense of peace and ease, tranquility, calm, then start to match your inhale and your exhale with an equal breath length. So in yoga, this is known as your samabhiti. So inhaling and exhaling for the same breath length. We're going to do this for six breaths, unless you feel that for yourself, your breath is already rhythmic and even, and you again feel yourself more at ease with each inhale and exhale. Now what I'd like you to become aware of is how you are composed of the same as the universe. You're composed of earth, of water, of fire, of space, and of ether. And so with air, ether, fire, water, and earth, I want you to just notice in your own body how each of those elements are expressed. So you may notice that for your body, the physical body, that there's a certain weight, a density. And really allow yourself to feel that right now. You feel your palms as resting on your legs. And your buttocks resting on your chair, or your mat, the floor, or cushion.
And then think for yourself, what are the qualities of earth? And how is that expressed in your physical body? And just as your body is nourished by the earth, you too nourish. So as you're sitting here, I'd like you to now bring your attention to the element fire. And think of how fire is used in your own body in order for you to maintain your physical form, your nourishment, and your life experience. How also is fire used for you in your life experience? How does fire burn away the impurities in the body, the impurities in the mind? How does the element of fire digest the food that we eat that becomes our physical being? And also, how does fire also allow us to digest that which we see, that which we take into our mind, that which we experience? So what are the qualities of fire? And how do those relate to you? And now think of the element water. How water is used in your own body. The importance of water in being able to sustain oneself or this physical form or this life experience. What are the qualities of water? How do those qualities affect you physically, emotionally, mentally? How could you? Use water in your own life to benefit you. Water is an element, as we know, that can change form, yet still retain itself. How can you also, through your life, transform at different times and yet still retain your essence, who you are. How does that provide you with a sense of freedom, of knowing that no matter how you change, you still always retain your essence? How can you liken that to yourself as a spiritual being? And now bring your attention to your breath. Feel the expansion of your breath in your body. Mm -hmm. 
Notice where the breath is moving. How does the breath affect your mental state, your emotional state, and your physical well being? Where else do you see the element air? How does it express itself? If you can't see it, how do you know it exists? Now think of the element space or ether. Where is space in your body? Where is space in your mind? Where is space between the thoughts you think, the words you speak, the actions you take? Where else is space? What does space provide? What happens when there's too little space or too much space? What is your experience of space? What is the interplay of each of these elements together in your body, in your mind, and you as spirit? Now choose one element that resonates for you. One element that resonates on a deep level. What is it about that element? Why does it resonate? And now bring your awareness to as much about that element as you can. Is there a feeling? What is that feeling? Is there a sound? What is that sound? Is there a taste? How does that element express itself? Is there a multitude of forms it takes? How 
how could you integrate more of this element into your life? How would it benefit you to do so? And now just be here with that. Is there an element that doesn't resonate for you? What are the qualities, again, of that particular element? It doesn't feel in alignment with you. And why? Is there an aspect to this element that could assist you? How? And why? Just be with that. Remain with this. And now bring your attention to the base of your spine. And feel yourself as rooted. Connected to the earth. Stable solid, dense, slow, supportive, consistent. And now bring your attention a little further up. And just below your belly, allow yourself to think of the element water.
what being the qualities of water. Creative. Sensual. Changeable. What else comes to you? Can you just be with that? And then moving up by your navel and just below and thinking of the element of fire and transformation, active, dynamic, powerful. And then continue up, moving towards the center of your chest. And the element of air, unchangeable movement. Spacious, free. And then continue to move up the base of your throat space. Expansive. Empty and all encompassing. What for you comes up? And then slowly bring your tension up. Point between your eyebrows. And into the crown of your head and take a deep inhale through your nose as though you're drawing all the energy of the earth up along your spine and pulling up with it each of the different elements and then exhale slowly and completely out your mouth or your nose and feel each of those elements and taking their place in your body, making up who you are, surrounding you and within you, each of these elements. Knowing that you are not separate from anything. All that is within you is around you. And now be with that for six breaths. And then once you come to your sixth breath, bring your hands together at your heart. 
And then take a deep inhale through your nose. And a long exhale out your mouth. And place your right hand over top of your lap, in your lap, and bring your thumbs to me. When you are ready, allowing your eyes to open, the light to enter into your eyes and into your heart. The light within me honors the light within me. Namaste. <laughs>